I always wanted that white boy. Got that white. I am the master of all bulldogs, man. And I approve this message, man. What's good, man? What's good, people? What's good, people? Oh, everything is blessings to everybody. Blessings to everybody. Blessings. Yo, I appreciate my haters, man. I appreciate them, man. Yo, I appreciate my haters, man. I appreciate people that want to be like me. I appreciate people that that takes my name and use my names. Yo, I appreciate them, bro. I appreciate... Yo, this little kid has my name. I must be doing something right if a person takes my name and want to put his name on my name. I don't understand these people, bro. They want to be like me. I don't know. But, yo, I'm here, man. What's up, people? How y'all doing, man? Sorry for the um, internet problem. We got internet problems. But yo, I appreciate y'all watching. You know what I'm saying? You don't want to see dogs. I just showed you a dog. You know? It's a dog for you. Nice dog over right there, man. Nice built. Everything. That's Tara and, and um, Titus pup. Getting big. I'm going to breed that back to her brother. I mean, not her brother, um, her uncle. I don't have Titus no more. I'm going to breathe it back to her uncle. What's up, people? Blessings to everybody. Yo, blessings to my haters, man. I know y'all why y'all mad. Because y'all got one dog. Y'all people that have one dog. I'm mad, man. Blessings to y'all, man. Or Blessings to everybody, man. Blessings to everybody, man. Appreciate y'all watching. Hope y'all doing it well. Hope y'all taking care of your animals. Hope y'all testing them of doing what you're supposed to do with your animals, right? Can't stop a master, bro. Cannot stop a master. You can talk about them. That means if I ain't getting talked about, I ain't doing nothing, bro. Word. Real facts, bro. Blessings to them, man. Blessings to all them people that used to talk about me. Master this and master that. Chill. Word. Blessings to them, man. Blessings to them. Lessons to them. Y'all doing this this um Tuesday? Y'all doing almost October. We in almost in October, man. Hope y'all doing good. American bullies and band dogs, two different breeds, two different crosses, two different mixers, two different sauces. It's not the same, bro. American bulldog. American bully, totally different breed. Some people put Pressa in it. Some people put County Coso in the American bullies. Some people put American Bulldog. They're all different. Some put some people put staff in them. And the band dog, right? Ingredients is real game bred pit bull to any type of master with pedigree. With family tree. With pedigree, with family tree. You take two pure dogs, cross them together, 
take puppies off of that. Then take another different game bred pit bull with a different type of master with pedigree, breed them together, get puppies off of that, breed them puppies to the, the, the first litter that you have. That's the ingredients of a band dog. American bully. Got French, Paul, English, Presser, American Bulldog. Got all, all kinds of shit mixed up in it. That's why it's, it won't work without the pedigree. Real facts. Outcross, right? Different blood you're putting into your dog. A different different blood. That's an outcross. You inbreed, you line breed, then you take a different blood and put it into that inbreed and outbreed. And inbreed. Take that cross, right? Different blood. Like take um example. American Bully, right? You have Ray's Edge, Gotti, Gray Line, G Line, Dex, Remison, Remy, Remy Bloodline, right? So you take the uh, Ray's Edge and Gotti, you inbred, line bred, then you take that um, G Line and you put it in there, or that Gray Line and you put it in there. That's an outcross. That's what you call an outcross. That's what you call an outcross. Outcross. Now you understand what an outcross is? You understand what an outcross is, right? Or I take a G, Red Boy Jocko, right? Inbred that, line braid that, and put Eli in it. That's an outcross. The Eli is the outcross. You understand? You're welcome. You're welcome. You're blessed, bro. That's what I'm here, man. To bless people. That's all I'm here to do is bless people. Bless people, man. Bless y'all, man. Yo, real facts. What y'all want to talk about, man? Yo, what y'all do with flies, man? When flies are on your dog, that means you ain't cleaning up that shit. You ain't putting shampoo or bleach in that area. You ain't, you ain't putting soap and bleach in that area. So that's why the flies come. Think about that too. <laughs> what you said, King? Do you have to outcross the meat? And block? Yeah, you do. You, you, you still got a line breed and inbreed to make them pure. Then you got to outcross because you don't want no, no um, too much inbreeding problems. Cause you will get inbreeding problems. You will get that inbreeding problem. You will get um, third leg, two two um, two tails. <laughs> you will get two tails, third leg, three eyes. Yo, you will get a. Stories, man. This is live, live, real life stories, bro. The more you inbreed, the more you will have, right? That that defect. You know what a defect is, right? You know what that is, right? You know what a defect is? You gotta remember that. You will get a defect. It's a band doggy. It is. It's not a band dog, but it's a band doggy. Because a band dog is mixed, it's mixed with different different breeds. Thank you, sir. I appreciate you watching me. Subscribe, bro. Subscribe to my channel. Does, does he have papers and pedigree? 
because you have papers and pedigree. That's the key, bro. Papers, pedigree, testing for eyes, heart, elbows, hips. That's another key. The first key is testing for eyes, heart, elbows, hips. The second key is having papers and pedigree. That's the second key. That's the key. Key of breeding. That's the key of success. That's the key of success, man. Testing for, for all health disease and then having papers and pedigree, that's the top of the line right there. How, what, how I got, you got the paperwork on your, your bullies? You have the paperwork, you have the pedigree. You know, when, when you bought your dog, did the um, person give you the pedigree? Did the person give you the pedigree or the papers or whatever? If you didn't, then I don't know, what's wrong, bro? Them are not reputable breeders. They're not. They're not a reputable breeder. They ain't giving you the papers and the pedigree. They are some backyard breeders, man. Real facts. Uh, when people say papers don't mean nothing, that means they don't have papers. They do not have pedigree. They don't have nothing. They just buy dogs from a crackhead, from a backyard breeder, or a, a dog thief. You gotta remember that. There's dog thieves out here too. You gotta be careful with them too. You gotta be careful with these dog thieves. The BSL is a dog thief. The um, SPCA is a dog thief. Um, the HSUS is a dog thief. Peter is a dog thief. There's a lot of dog thief. <laughs> Real facts. There's a lot of dog thief that take dogs from people, kill them, and put them down. That's a dog thief. That's a thief. What you what you do with thieves, right? What you do with them. You lay their ass out, right? That's what you do with thieves, right? I hate a thief, bro. I hate a thief. I can't stand a thief. I hate a thief with a passion. Them thieves, bro, need their ass kicked. I don't want nobody stealing my car. I don't want nobody stealing anything in my house. My dogs is my property. I don't want them stealing that either. I hate dogs, beef. So you got papers, pedigree. Yo, did did um did they get they tested for everything? Did they put the chip in the back of the neck just in case your dog gets stolen or in a in a pound that you can get your dog back? Did they give you all of that? Did they give you two two to five years guarantee on hips? Nah, you go. Um, Scott, Alan Scott was seventeen when he started his his um American bull bulldogs. When he Alan Scott was seventeen when he had his first dogs and and made his own breed of the high bred American bulldogs. Alan Scott, Alan Scott bloodline, Scott bloodline. He was seventeen. You ain't never too young, bro. Never. Got to get with an OG. You never too young, bro. And you got to get the right dogs when you're 17. You got to get the top of the line dogs, man. You got to get that credit better. Got to have a nice job. Got to get some land. Some people, this 17-year-olds have their own land. This 18-year-olds have their own land. Or they, they saved from from 17 to, to 18 and got that, that land. Build that strong foundation. That's real facts. Build that strong foundation. Real facts. To invest in your own self. You got to invest in your own self.
You got to, and she, she um, had two, two um, period cycles. She had a first period and a second period. She didn't, you got, I'll wait. The female got to be the oldest one to breed. The female got to be the oldest one. The male can breed as a teenager. Think about that, people. And you can invest in your own self. Invest in your own self. Make your own company. Make your own way of life. Real facts. You can do dog training. You could knock on people's door and hand them a, a flyer and say, we, we clean dogs, we wash dogs, we walk dogs. If, we, if you need a babysitter, we hear to babysit your dog. It's all kinds of ways. You could have, people say, yo, I grew up in the hood, right? When I grew up in the hood, right? I did paper routes. I used to ride on a bike paper route when I was young, 13, 12. I grew up in the hood, riding on the bike, throwing penny savers, saving up the money. There's all kinds of ways to save up money. Taking care of somebody's yard. You, you take care of that yard every week. They paying you. Real facts. Get your grime on, bro. Yourself. And if you're not... If you ain't scared to knock on people's door and tell them, yo, I'll, I'll take care of your yard. That's real facts. Real facts. Bro, I used to used to walk down the street with dogs, man. From from the south to the north, walk from from the, the south to the the north side of, of the hood. What'd you say? Oh, no, nah, no. Nah. I, I said, yo, that story, right? It was a real live story. Playing handball, right? It was playing handball, right? I had my dogs with me playing handball. We was on in the hood playing handball. We was betting. We was betting, right? And the knucklehead didn't want to pay me my money because we won, right? So they tried to jump me. My dogs got loose, and I cleared the whole park with two dogs and a pistol. That's real facts. That's real facts. That's real facts. I cleared the whole park, and I told people this is my park. Got a problem with it? Call whoever you want to call. Real facts. I was, I was young, man. I was young and crazy. <laughs> Didn't care. Still don't care a little bit. I care a lot. I cared it back then also. Because I ain't do none of that dumb stuff too much. Real facts. But yo. Y'all have a blessed day, man. Just checking in with my subscribers. Appreciate um, Sheba. This goes out to Sheba, um, Carolina, Mutt Bull, that using the master of all bulldogs, man. This goes out to you, man. Appreciate you, man. Appreciate you. I'm the original master of all bulldogs, man. And I approve this message on a... You do? You own 11? That's what's up, bro. That's the real original OD English Bulldog, man. Ain't nothing better than the 11s. Ain't nothing better than the 11s. Just made a new video yesterday. All right, I'm going to check it out, bro. I'm going to check it out. Yo, just yo, message me, and I'll check it out. Yeah. Real facts. <laughs> Real facts.
But yo, yo, who has the limit, man? You got a male or a female, bro. Levitz is the greatest bulldog there is, the original bulldog. Word. These other wannabe oldies, they're not oldies. They hybrid bulldogs with a with a with the name like they tagging the American bullies as a pit bull. They tag the these English bulldog cross to American and call them oldies. Shaylu, yes. Shaylu. It's S H U L A. Shaylu. One of the top ass dogs in the world, bro. Rest in peace. Shaylu. That Shaylu was a big jughead, too, boy. He was an awesome dog. Shaylu. Real facts. Bro, real facts, Shay Lou. Missed that nigga, boy. What's up, man? Appreciate you watching. What would you say? And that's what's up. But yeah, I appreciate you, man. Dogs is barking. Always working, always, always in the shed, always working, always doing something, bro. But yo, www.oldbulldogs.com, 843-688-5098-347-272-9141. Yo, 